Today our journey brings us to Retro Emporium in beautiful Kent, Washington, part video game store, a whole lot of retro here, very nostalgic. Let's step inside and see what we can find. And as soon as you walk in, you start seeing this classic candy. Some of these candy bars like Zagnut, man, I haven't seen these in years. Fantastic. Can I grab some of those before I leave too? Uh, when you look to your side, um, I saw the Care Bears movie playing on VHS on an old school CRT TV. This is uh, what a fun, what a fun idea here. Got some other uh, things on the corner there. How fun. See, I love stores like this. I love stores like this. You never know what you're going to find. I think I used to have one of these old school wooden consoles too for my TV. <laughs> you got some non-sports cards. I mean, they used to make these cards for everything. And it looks like they have just about everything here at this store too. Around right the corner, you start seeing the video game stuff. Uh, nice uh, selection here. You know, not the biggest selection in the world, but a little bit of something for everyone anyway. What do you see? What do you need? I see Nintendo, I see Atari back there, some uh, controllers as well, as needed. Sure. You might just find it here. Some more cool stuff, too. Gotta love the Sega CD, got a CDX there. Yeah, no doubt about it. I'm looking over here, that's caught my eye. Got some fabulous imports. Super Famicom, Famicom as well. Something you need. Not a lot of stores carries imports, and it's always cool to see some imports here at Retro Emporium. All the way down there. Look at that. Even uh, even the Nintendo 64 imports. Got some classic drinks too. What was the last time you saw RC Cola? <laughs> you got the ramen as well. Uh, Diet Right. I <laughs> didn't even know they still made that. A few Nintendo games to select from. Got Fax Xanadu, one of my favorites. Great price on that game too. Haven't checked out Fax Xanadu. I'd recommend grabbing it. What else we got over here? Look at this. Some more games for various systems as well. Some cool backpacks, and this caught my eye too. Classic, old school, from 1982, this Pac-Man tote. I should have bought it. <laughs> I, I resisted though, I left it there. Some great stuffed animals, you can never go wrong, man. Get something for everyone. Um, I love the fact when stores sell their own shirts, these are only 10 bucks each. I bought one, I walked out of there with one of those. Great material too. Not just video games, also going vintage, we're going old school. Got vinyl. And cassettes. I still got a working cassette player. I might grab some Culture Club. Hey, what, what about a, uh, what about docking, right? Come on now. Some of your favorites maybe now available on cassette. <laughs> this is cool to see. Oh, uh, how about this? This is another thing I should have. In retrospect, man, I could have bought this. I wouldn't know what to do with it, but you know. <laughs> That's so much of what this story is about uh, for me and for maybe for most. It's just cool to see and the fact that you can buy anything you see. But, I mean, sometimes it's just fun to look. Like, you know, even if I bought it, even if I got it, you know, what would I do with it? You know, put it on the shelf, I guess. Yeah, I could. Let's see, Star Trek, Star Wars. A lot of great Star Wars stuff here. Got these old school posters. I used to love looking through these at other stores, too. Oh, man, look at this. Got some great Transformers here. That's a cool one. I can see I can see myself hanging that one up too. Got some movie posters too. Curious about the anime and video games. There we go. Full Metal Alchemist. Cool. Another great one here. Breath of the Wild. Sure. Grab one of those for you. All right. Some more cool toys too. You see anything that you used to have? Remember those flip head uh, Power Rangers back there? Got some cool wrestling stuff. I like this one too, Honky Tonk Man in the uh, Retro Fest <laughs> arcade machine. Oh, fun. Greatest Intercontinental Champion of all time, I'm telling you. I love it. Ninja Turtles as well. And then you, it's like you just walked into a video store in this back room here. We got the DVDs on one side, got the VHS on the other side. Old school, man, I'm telling you. This place is great. You know, this, you gotta keep your eye out on VHS, too, because sometimes there are some movies on VHS that never made it to DVD. These always catch my eye, too. I love these old, uh, kind of Hong Kong action films. Some of these have, like, several on one disc. <laughs> Just grab one. Sounds like a Friday night to me, man. And then uh, when you come to the front desk on checkout, you'll see some more cool stuff in the cabinet down here, too. And this is just one store. I've also taken you on tours of other various uh, retro game stores and whatnot. Make sure you check out this playlist and other videos of other tours that I've taken you on. Make sure you're subscribed. I do at least two videos a week. Always something new coming out. We'll see you soon.